Hey guys, it's Tim and this is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. So we told you recently, you know, Neville is cleared. He doesn't have to go be under contract by the WWE anymore. He apparently does not have a no compete clause. But then when promoters have reached out to him recently, he's told them he can't take any bookings right now. Now, we don't know exactly why he can't take any bookings, whether that was in part of the agreement in getting out of his WWE contract, whether he has something else where he can't work certain places. I don't know, but it does look like there's one big match on the table for New Japan and Neville. Will Ospreay has made it publicly known that he would like to take on Neville at the upcoming Wrestle Kingdom 13 event. Whether Will Ospreay is the IWGP Junior Heavyweight Champion by that time or not is to be seen, as this weekend he will be taking on Marty Skrull in a semi-final match to become the new Junior Heavyweight Champion. If he's not the champion, then this would make a lot of sense to try and get the Neville match, because it would be a very high-profile match for both guys. Not only just putting Neville and Will Ospreay in there together would be great, but it could be Neville's first match since leaving the WWE last October and for New Japan Pro Wrestling, it can really help out New Japan in getting those eyes from American fans. Last year, they did bring in Chris Jericho and had him face Kenny Omega, which got a lot of American eyes on the product that didn't actually or wasn't going to watch the product before this. Neville could do the same thing. Neville was a huge star in NXT and the WWE. Everybody loved Neville that I've ever heard about. They always complimented his work, everything. And so if you say, hey, Neville's going to work one of the top four matches at Wrestle Kingdom, watch on New Japan World, watch the replays on Access TV. That can help a lot because he's got a pretty credible big name with, with hardcore WWE fans. So whether this match ever does take place or not is to be seen, but Will Ospreay has made it publicly known that he would like to take on Neville or Pac or whatever name he's going to go by the upcoming Wrestle Kingdom 13 event January 4th, 2019. If we do hear anything else on this challenge made by Will Ospreay, we'll have it for you right here on Pro Wrestling Unlimited. But that's going to do it for this episode. Remember to comment below, like and share this video, like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, subscribe here on YouTube, and follow PWUnlimited.net for the latest in pro wrestling news.